the listless palm trees catch the breeze above the pile-built huts that edge the salt lagoon there is no breeze to cool the heat of love no wind from land or sea at night or noon perfumed and robed i wait my lord for you and my heart waits alert with strained delight my flowers are loath to close as though they knew that you will come to me before the night in the veranda all the lights are lit and softly veiled in rows to please your eyes between the pillars flying foxes flit their wings transparent on the lilac skies come soon my lord come soon i almost fear my heart may fail me in this keen suspense break with delight at last to know you near pleasure is one with pain if too intense i envy these the steps that you will tread the jasmine that will touch you by its leaves when in your slender height you stoop your head at the low door beneath the palm thatched eaves for though you utterly belong to me and love has done his utmost twixt us twain your slightest careless touch yet seems to be that keen delight so much akin to pain the night breeze blows across the still lagoon and stirs the palm trees till they wave above our pile-built huts oh come my lord come soon there is no breeze to cool the heat of love every time you give yourself to me the gift seems greater and yourself more fair this slight built palm thatched hut has come to be a temple since my lord you visit there and as the water gurgling softly goes among the piles beneath the slender floor i hear it murmur as it seaward flows of the great wonder seen upon the shore the miracle that you should come to me whom the whole world seeing can but desire it is as though some white star stooped to be the messmate of our little cooking fire leaving the glory of his purple skies and the white friendship of the crescent moon and yet i look into your brilliant eyes and find content oh come my lord come soon perfumed and robed i wait for you i wait the flowers that please you wreathed about my hair and this poor face set forth in jewelled state so more than proud since you have found it fair my lute is ready and the fragrant drink your lips may honour how it will rejoice losing its life in yours the lute i think but wastes the time when i might hear your voice but you desired it therefore i obey your slightest as your utmost wish or will whether it please you to caress or slay it would please me to give obedience still i would delight to die beneath your kiss i envy that young maiden who was slain so her warm blood flowing beneath the crease 
might ease the wounded sultan of his pain if she loved him as i love you my lord there is no pleasure on the earth so sweet as is the pain endured for one adored if i lay crushed beneath your slender feet i should be happy ah come soon come soon see how the stars grow large and white above the land breeze blows across the salt lagoon there is no breeze to cool the heat of love end of poem <laughs>